you know, this thing, uh, these two trades were in deep trouble. Okay, so we have a market open and let's see how everything changes. You're going to see uh, the breadth of the market would be the important one to follow and that should all turn into uh, into very bearish quickly. And so that's uh, what we are seeing. So Netflix has moved into very bearish. So as you can see, that was one of the stocks we were trying to uh, take a trade on. So uh, we are about a couple of minutes uh, into the into the open. So I don't want to rush into it. Let's just uh, see how uh, how these uh, signals and the first bar goes. OK, so breadth is very weak. As you can see, Johnson and Johnson, the only one that is uh, showing uh, some very bullish there. All right. So here we go. We have um, we have weakness continuing into the second bar. Netflix is at 331, it's trying to make a little bit of a move there. So here we we have a the 325 would be between 425 and 460. Okay, so that bar is over, pretty weak there still. So uh, let's see where we stand. We shouldn't be too much different. Yeah, so it's just about. Uh, a little bit on the positive side so let's just continue to watch here okay so we're up about 220 dollars so not quite 20 percent but um, let's see if we can get any anything better out of this but uh, seems like some stability coming in there at this level rather it's not uh, on any particular uh, bar at that level the S&P doesn't uh, want to go below 34 and uh, Netflix is now down 8.8, so almost $9. So we should have a decent profit, I think, here, $210, $200. So now it's up about $240, close to 25%. I mean, close to 20%. We would want to see some improvement in the position because if that's not going to happen, then we might as well just take the profit. S&P also wants to recover, and so does uh, Netflix. So as you can see, so we have about a 15% guys over here and definitely looking like it wants to uh, uh, it wants to get some stability there. So if you see, OK, they're all trying to move up. So I'm going to try to get 520 and see if we can. Uh, OK, we got 520. So that trade is closed uh, 180. So it's about a little less than 15%, but it's not improving. And so, uh, you know, we had a little bit better profit there, but that's OK. Uh, just a little about 14% over here on this trade. Let's go back to our market watch and see if we can find something else. And so here we are. You can see all this is also recovering. And so I think it was a good move to get it off. And so I'm just going to get ready on Amazon for a quick counter trade. OK, and uh, just a quick counter trade, not, you know, not something great. And uh, Amazon also wants to move up. So let's get one contract in over there. OK, 28.35. So we are looking at a $2,800 trade. I'm going to close out Netflix and just look at Amazon. So the important thing is the breadth. You can see the sentiment is shifting from the very bearish to at least a neutral. Now you can see most of the stocks are neutral. So uh, obviously sentiment is shifting to some extent there. Let's just quickly take a look at uh, Amazon up about 87. Not a big deal. But certainly the breadth of the market is changing. And so that, uh, you know, that will give us a clue that uh, we are OK. We are uh, we are in the in the right trade. It's a contra trade. So you don't want to uh, let it run too much. If you have a decent profit, you want to take it off. And so let's wait and see. It's still developing. 